Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Today is the 5th of September, 2022. I'm here on Fort Street in Trenchtown. Fort Street in Trenchtown is where some of the greatest musicians come from, like Cynthia Slass and Ernie Wrangling and the great legendary Dean Fraser. Today is a very sad day, though, because I came to Fort Street with my friend, King Ottawa. And I didn't know I was sitting beside someone who really lost a loved one recently. I read about it in the newspaper, but I didn't know that destiny would let me sit right beside this lady. In my hand is a photograph of Boys Town Infant and Primary School student. His name is Devado Maitland. Now Devado Maitland is that 14 year old little youth that was shot two nights ago in Trenchtown. I'm here with Delisha Malcolm, his cousin. And I didn't know I was going to be sitting beside this lady. And the Spirit of the Almighty told me to come here with King Ottawa. I just felt the present that I had to be on the street because I love Trenchtown. Trenchtown is a place that I've been coming to for a long time. We've done a number of shows in Trenchtown. And I know we have some beautiful people in Trenchtown. Great people, people with talent, people that have done great things for this beautiful historical community. Delicia, how are you doing today? I know it cannot be too good. How are you today, Coping? Yeah, so bad. I mean, it's just so bad. As my daughter did at the same time, we could have reached to one other. So, so bad. Can you see what can you eat? Without getting into depth of the details, ladies and gentlemen, as you know, the newspaper mentioned that there was a shooting, uh, someone shoot after someone else, and as a matter of that shooting, um, little Navarro Maitland was shot and killed in the head. Now, how would the incident happen? If you look at the gate where the shot came to and hit the wall and then ricochet from the wall to his head, it is is one of those fluke kind of actions. Even though the shot should never have been fired, but it's those fluke action. So what we're trying to do here is to turn negative into positive. Let the life of Nevada Maitland just not go in vain. Let it be uh, the catalyst for change. The catalyst for change. You know, and I'm gonna be here the night of the setup. I'm gonna be here. Tonight is the third night. 
Well, okay, well, yeah, you know, like I'm from the country and we celebrate the ninth night of the passing. But in Kingston, it's different. Today is like the third day of the passing. And I'm gonna come back here later on tonight and sit with my friend Delisha and just absorb their pain because I understand what it is to lose a loved one. I know the community is mourning along with you. How was the support? Did you get support from outside? Of people coming to kind of talk to you and Okay, the leader of the opposition, Mark Golden, was here. Okay, great, 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 great. He will, he will, he will. Boy, it's a very sad situation, ladies and gentlemen. Um, we always want peace because when we have peace, when Big Stone can come on Fourth Street and sit amongst you and if I if I want something to drink I feel free to go get something to drink and I can bring a friend and bring another friend and another friend and so the businesses in the community can flourish because even if you don't have the money within the community people is longing and wanting to come to Trench Town because Trench Town is a historical place. Fourth Street, the great Ernie Wrangling, the great Dean Fraser, the great Cynthia Slass. Can you imagine how beautiful this place is? So we have to learn, I understand, sometimes when we have a scab, and when the scab has been there for years, and you think that scab has healed, but when you take a stack, if you just move your finger on that scab and remove that crust, you'll see blood oozing. We have to find a way how we can heal, remove this cap and heal. It's very hard because sometimes what do you say to someone who loses a loved one? It's very hard to tell a mother that, you know, don't do anything about my child's death. And sometimes it can be an only child, you know? Recently we had a beautiful thing on First Street, Carter for Youth with King Ottawa. You know, it's an initiative that he started seven years ago all by himself until because of his hard work and working and working and working, other people see the work and we come on board and we help him to put it on a bigger scale. Nevada, myth and death should not be in vain. Let's use it positively. Let his death be a catalyst for change. I love you, Mama. Can I get a hug? I feel your pain. I feel your pain. Yeah? Wow. Well, you know, just hold tight. We understand, you know. I know a lot of people watching my program. If you want to offer some assistance, reach your mouth up. You just reach out and we'll give all the necessary telephone numbers and you can speak to her personally. I know there's a lot of people all around the world that want best for Jamaica. They're scared to come home. Reach out to this lady and help her and the family go through the pain that they endure. Thank you so much for talking to me. We want to big up if you can. We want to share out to you. It's my daughter, Cranberry. Mm -hmm. Kelly Rose. Just thank for the godly. Should I not be with you? Let's give thanks to the Almighty for that it was more than just one. You know what I mean? Thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Please share this video. Let this video go viral so people from all over the world can see and feel the pain. I just want to take time out and pick up my camera woman, Anika Elliott. She did a remarkable job. Thank you so much. Welcome. My Anagaya, my Yedos, Yanagade, my Yanana, Mkume, Moshe, Mkume, baby, baby, Mkume, baby,